now UCAD is opening another investigation and if Tyson Fury is found guilty then he could face the eight year ban from the sport of boxing which Tyson Fury don't give a shit about he don't care about getting banned for eight years he just beat Deontay Wilder by any means necessary he just made a ton of money he don't care he gonna ride off into the sun and say hey I'm the champ you know hey I won all the belts oh they had to get rid of me he gonna, you know, he gonna have his little his little, own little twist on this shit he don't care about he wanna retire anyway he don't care about getting banned what needs to happen is the fight between Deontay Wilder and Tyson Fury 2 needs to be ruled a no contest and the belts need to be returned to Deontay the Bronze Bomber Wilder that's what should happen <laughs> dude you know I, I was wondering why why are all these idiots uh, these uh LDBC idiots going around saying give Wilder his belt back. Now I get it. It's cause this it's cause this guy, it's cause the godfather, this old ass dude. For, first of all, if you guys didn't know, 78 Sports TV is the biggest, and I mean the biggest Deontay Wilder cocksucker on this fucking uh on YouTube. You know, you think blood blue, blue blood is, you think uh Fanon is, you think uh Barbershop conversations, even that young Farrah guy. No, 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 no. Blue Blood, I mean, excuse me, 78 Sports TV was the first guy in the ODBC who started sucking off Deontay Wilder. Like, he was the one who started this shit. There's interviews of him sucking off Deontay Wilder. They go back into to 2012. Like, this guy has been riding Wilder's dick since the start. You know, you know what I'm saying? He was the first guy who started calling him my king. And then all the other leeches that follow this guy uh, started repeating what he what he's done. He's basically like the LDBC uh, creator, the LDBC leader. This fat fuck who claims he's a bodybuilder. He claims he's a bodybuilder, 78 sports to be. But does this fat fuck look like a bodybuilder builder to you? He looks like a fat fuck. You heard what he said in this video. He said that. The WBC should change the results to a no contest. Change the results to a no contest and strip Fury of his belt and hand it over to Wilder. How ridiculous is that? That's not going to happen, 78 Sports TV. It's not going to fucking happen. I know you want that to happen so fucking bad. It's not going to happen because Fury did not cheat against Deontay Wilder in that fucking rematch. By the way, he also didn't cheat in the first fucking fight. So why the fuck would they strip him? All these accusations that are going to from Fury from that farmer that you're they are you know jet jerking off right now because you're so happy he came out with that news has nothing to do with the fucking WBC has nothing to do with him beating Deontay Wilder. So why do you keep acting like that has something to do with him beating Deontay Wilder? Why? That's that's like the narrative that like these these LDBC dudes are like look are like going like are doing this. They're like, look, 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 guys, you see, you see how he paid this farmer, supposedly paid this farmer to cover up. I told you he was a cheat. And then of course, this guy is sucking off young Farrell's dick. And he's like, you know, he's blowing young Farrell, you know, off 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 air. And he's like, Oh, you see what young Farrell did? I'm telling you right now, had young Farrell not come out with those accusations, these fuckers. These LDBC dudes would have never done this, would have never gone along with what Young Farrell was doing. The only reason they did this is because they hate the fact that Tyson Fury beat Deontay Wilder, all right? And they were looking for an excuse. So that's why, if you notice, before Young Farrell came out with this whole uh, tampering with the glove nonsense, he was going around, they were going around accusing Fury of being a dirty fighter. You know, he was using illegal tactics against. Deontay Wilder he might have possibly failed the PED test that's what they were saying that that was like the the narrative they were painting oh you see Fury won but he he was dirty Fury was a dirty man they even they, they were even suggesting that Fury was planning on ducking Deontay Wilder yeah this guy 78 Sports TV Deontay Wilder cocksucker was even su suggesting that oh perhaps Fury perhaps uh he's ducking Tyson Fury I mean he, he perhaps he's ducking Deontay Wilder but of course, once they saw uh, Young Pharaoh come out with that tempering glove nonsense, 
they hopped on Young Pharaoh's dick instantaneously. They started sucking off Young Pharaoh's dick. They started sucking him off clean, bro. They sucked him off dry. And they started all using that narrative. And now that's all they do. All they do is make videos talking about the glove gate shit. That's all they do because they don't, they're scared, bro. These people are scared. They know that Deontay Wilder can't beat Tyson Fury. They're humiliated. And that's why you got idiots like this saying they should just fucking change the results to a no contest and get the, the and give the belt to Deontay Wilder. I can't stand 78 Sports TV. This old ass dude who's been on YouTube for for like a decade, man. Pathetic. Anyway, guys, so I have to say thanks for watching. And I'm out. Subscribe if you enjoyed the video, please.